so uh it's uh it's been a while how you doing uh hey how's it going so uh yeah what is going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video uh i am finally uploading my well not well mm, i forgot how to do a commentary it's been a while but uh, apologies friends it, it, it has been a while the uh it <laughs> I come oh dear god I forgot to do a commentary it's only been like a week I lied it has not been a week wait has it oh god so uh hope hopefully you guys are doing well all that stuff welcome back to another episode of the master ninja difficulty playthrough for ninja guide sigma 2 uh I, I was honestly stuck on chapter 10 for a hot second I, I was stuck here for a while and I finally was able to beat it with some fucking patience that I needed to develop on the spot because I it is I'm learning how to be a little bit more selfish with my healing and all that stuff you'll see that in the video I barely healed I barely did any of that stuff until like the final boss the reason why I'm starting to be the, the main reason why I'd, I want to be a little bit more selfish is just mainly because I feel like if you be a little bit more selfish and like ego shit <laughs> at least for me anyway I know for a fact I'm going to get my shit pushed in by the final boss and I'm going to need every healing every uh, nimpo that I can get so I like to save those as much as I can for the main boss and I feel like I should probably ego shit and just be a little bit more selfish with my healing I don't even think selfish is the right word I'm just kind of saying it but I, I definitely feel like I should act that way towards uh I definitely feel like I should act that way towards my uh my healing and all that stuff because again I'm gonna get my shit pushed by by the final boss and i well of the chapter anyway and i definitely did that's why i was stuck here for a little bit i was getting my ass kicked so hard that i i contemplated quitting the entire playthrough but i'm not gonna do that at, at the very least i'm gonna finish ninja gaiden um at the very least i'm gonna finish ninja gaiden sigma 2 i'm gonna finish this playthrough on its hardest difficulty and then i i don't know i still haven't decided whether or not i want to continue uh razor's edge and Sigma 1 on Master Ninja difficulty because I kind of want to play through those games with live commentary and just kind of have some fun with it because I don't know I, I kind of miss the feeling of doing a live commentary this is still a little bit weird to me even though I need every ounce of concentration that I could get also too I could I can honestly I can probably just turn on my live commentary and just kind of have fun with it but uh, not on Master Ninja difficulty no sir I need as much concentration as I can get. I'm sure you guys would love to hear me rage and get pissed off too, but nah, no sir, I'm not doing that. So I haven't decided what it is that I'm gonna do yet. And also I'm not gonna lie, this is kind of putting a dent in my uploads because I haven't uploaded, ever since I started doing this, I haven't uploaded on a consistent basis. It's always just been like, oh, whenever I complete the chapter, but it's like, I don't wanna think of my uploads like that. Like, yes, I want to upload on a consistent basis, but also I kind of want to take my time on the Master Ninja difficulty because I know I'm going to get my ass kicked and I need patience. And this is the first time that I've attempted the difficulty, especially doing it on YouTube and all that stuff. So I kind of wanted to take my time with it. But, you know, there's other stuff that I want to upload. I want to upload some more Halo, maybe a little bit. Never mind. I was going to say Destiny, but never mind. But I want to upload uh, a bunch of other videos. I kind of want to play Halo. I've been playing a lot of Halo recently. And I, I just want to kind of do other stuff and I feel like it's putting a dent in my like ideas because I'm so preoccupied and so focused on doing this and completing this before moving on to any other projects, which is also a good thing. But I, if, to me anyway, I, I view it as a double edged sword. And then on top of all this, I've kind of lost my motivation. Uh, it, it's I don't know. I, I've, I've been slowly losing and gaining my motivation for the past like few weeks already. Hopefully this is the start of me gaining my motivation back and all that stuff because I genuinely love uploading videos. I love editing. I love, you know, doing commentary and all that stuff. I love hanging out with the guys whenever we do, uh, you know, stupid shit whenever we play. Like it's just, it's so much fun to me. And I, I don't know. I like showcasing shit to you guys because I know you guys like to watch it. Um, hopefully again, hopefully this is the start, but, um, yeah sentimental stuff aside and all that stuff again this boss was a huge pain in the ass i used the dragon's fang and tiger's claw which is the dual katanas i used those to my advantage as best as i can i kind of did the same strat that everyone else does just dodge when he throws the fireballs and dodge dodge and then use the uh the forward y and it does that little thing and um yeah it, it, it does hit him but also i do the y y y um that also works too it's just a matter of trying to be it's just a matter of uh being patient 
and waiting until he finishes his attack. He does guard it and he will counter, but you'll be able to evade as long as you don't hit him with a full length combo while he's blocking. Because if you're hitting him with a full length combo while he's blocking, he's going to grab you and it grabs or an insta kill. And I didn't have a talisman of rebirth, so I was kind of limited on. I mean, I did, but. You know, I, I'm fucking dog shit, so I lost it. Anyway, but yeah, hopefully, again, hopefully this is the start of uh, my motive, my the gaining of my motivation back and all that stuff. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. If you do enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe and all that good stuff. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you guys in the next one.
力称賛に値するだが無意味